So for the first time on Legends, they just straight up offered us the ability to buy these tickets with money and then bundle them with a ton of other things. So of course, I did that and then also saved all my tickets from all the other videos I've made. And now we're just doing pure ticket summons. Are tickets worth or should you just get your Legends Limited Z Power? My my money is on the fact that you should get the Legends Limited Z Power. But right now, we have 10 tickets for the Kaioken. Uh, Evo boys, however you want to say it. I got I got to figure out what I want to what I want to nickname them and, and call them. The Blue Boys kind of works. Also, it's really close to Boo. I don't know, man. And then of course we have ten for Beast Gohan. But the thing is, I can get even more because I've summoned so much on these banners. So will we come away with any of the new Legends Limited characters? I don't know. You're going to stay tapped in to find out. And what I do know is hopefully you went down there and hit that red subscribe button. I was trying to hit a million and we're so freaking close, man. I would love to do it before the end of 2023. I know that sounds crazy. You look down there and you're like, man, you are close, but so is 2024. Well, that's because over 50% of you watching don't subscribe. We could hit it. I'm Bergamo the Crusher. Oh, you're not Bergamo. Not now, man. I'm trying to tell them to subscribe, bro. You're showing up. You're going to make them run the other way, but don't leave. Stay. <gasps> subscribe. Be part of something <gasps> wonderful. <laughs> As I waste tickets and, and all these things that could have been converted to Legends of Legacy Power. <laughs> all right, here we go. Uh, hopefully your guys' luck has went well. I honestly couldn't have anticipated a better part one to the celebration. I know Ryudin and I had a massive discussion about this just yesterday. If you haven't checked that out, that was a very fun video. Really, really good PvP matches in that. I, I really did enjoy the PvP in that video specifically. Um, and honestly, just enjoying Legends a ton. Like, Legends has been an absolute blast. No complaints for me right now on this game at all. Uh, besides equipment, man. Equipment is, is a drag. I won't lie. Equipment... It, it gives me it gives me flashbacks to playing Grand Cross, and I just didn't enjoy all the different aspects of how they monetize that game. And fortunately for me, I'm not addicted to the whole godly icon. Like I can use some S's, and I can be fine. You know, I can use a Z. I don't even need a Z plus. Like I'm fine. Bro. I promise you, it does not bother me. But I know it bothers a lot of people, and I know it can kind of get under people's skin. But yeah, for me specifically, it doesn't it doesn't bug me. So I'm just kind of like. Uh, it is what it is you know like it is what it is but uh yeah i just i don't know man the equipment stuff it just it bo bothers it oh, that's just deep blue bothers fire i mean it's just like it can take up so much time i know i've already discussed this but it really can just take up so much time and so i just like bro i could be playing pvp right now i could be I, space please bardock father father I've already used so many of these and I've got nothing but ra I'm random SPs, man. The most random of SPs. Please bring me home. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. The supersonic warrior dispo coming at you. And I'm coming at you guys with today's sponsor. I know I mentioned them a lot lately, but it's just the fact that it's still in stock. And I know that it probably won't be in stock for long because it's just so sick. But there's a new Evil Emperor. This is a combo little pack you can get over there by clicking the link down below in the description. I am sponsored by G Fuel and the fact that G Fuel has actual flavors that are related to the main content I literally make on my channel. Like this new Evil Emperor flavor. Yes, this is a real Dragon Ball Z flavor. It's got cranberry, cherry, raspberry, and strawberry, and it works so well. What's up, Kiwi? And the combo pack comes with this shaker cup, which I believe you say is when you say it lenticular. You see how it's like moving like that? But guess what? That's not even the best part of this. Look at this. Did you see that? Their aura, their aura is animated. How cool is that? It is so sick. So you get these two things inside this box. Again, you can check out by going over to gfield.com, clicking the link down below in the description. Uh, mine came with a sticker. I presume that they all come with stickers for that a sticker. It's just like, it's, sometimes it's just the little things, bro. It's the little things. So anyways, go pick one up. Use code nano. That saves you money and it supports the channel. And I appreciate you guys, for those of you that have done it. And gfield, thank you for sponsoring us. Really appreciate it. it makes these summons possible. <laughs> makes these summons much more possible and if you're like but nano these are tickets yeah i mean um the only way i got these was by spending actual chrono crystals to get the tickets <laughs> and i've not gotten anything bro i got i got day one gohan over here i got day one gohan over here day one we're on day like 2034 if i got that accurate by the way it's insane enough is enough
Enough is enough. Buhan. We got first anniversary Buhan. I did mention that in the ride video. I'm like, dude, you know, trying to think of what all they could do for next year. I mean, I think 2023 will probably go down. Will it go down as the best, best year of legends? It probably will. I, I definitely, there's no year before that even touches this year, in my opinion. Definitely some very hype moments. Uh, I'm definitely a fanboy of. Okay, we're just losing. I'm definitely a fanboy of 2021 Legends Fest. I am. It just is what it is. And I really, really liked Ultra Gogeta Blue last year. That's definitely one of my favorite units this game has ever released. Man, we're not batting so hot right now. We are not batting so hot at all right now. Okay. Anyways, I think when you look at it, though, as, a, as an overall, this year has been so crazy in terms of releases. So I don't know where they go from here in 2024. I mean, I presume they they know what they're, you know, they know what they're doing. I don't, I'm not saying that in like a condescending way. Truly, I, I presume they know what they're doing. And that next year will just surprise us. Ooh, I hope it surprises us with a Majin Vegeta. Dude, we get an Ultra MV. I'm telling you, y'all better come back to this channel, man. And just, you just, just watch. You just watch what happens, bro. I will red, I will red seven that guy. I'll do, I don't even really do showcases. I, I'm not a channel that necessarily does showcases specifically. I just play the game and have fun. But like, I might just straight up be like, yo, this is, this is him five times in Kai. You know, like, yeah, I got all the best equips. I got all the best everything, bro. Majin, Ultra Majin Vegeta. Anyways, uh, I don't know if we, if it made it into the video because Ryan and I talked a lot on and off camera, but one thing we did talk about, Pan, one thing we did talk about is that Ultra LFs could finally be a thing next year. Because, like, what is the step up? I, I think, you know, there's a there's a few obvious ones. You know, we you know tag characters, I wouldn't say they're necessarily, they're old-ish, I guess. They're not, like, old. I'm not, like, over them yet, personally. But the next step, I would, you know, there's got to be another step somewhere in the pipeline. I think that the VB ultimate was a taste of it, you know, getting to be a little more interactive with our ultimates and tapping the screen to, like, make it do more damage and have it, you know. And that was really cool. An interactive ultimate is, is really, really cool. But is it in-game fusion mechanic? You know, is it something we can't even imagine just yet? And and then other things too are again taking things that exist but combining them. Like we don't have an ultra tag unit yet. Um, we don't have a tag unit that transforms unless I'm not you know thinking of one. So like one of the examples is we could have like the tag Broly duo, the gods, and have them be in just Super Saiyan God, and uh, and then you have them transform after they fill their unique gauge. They transform into blues. We don't really have that yet unless I'm just like a vast oversight right now of all the tag units in the game you know that's something that could be cool and unique um again ultra tag unique could be cool and unique ultra legends limited could be cool and unique uh i don't know what that i don't know what that looks like now that we have legends limited abilities and we you know like i don't know that sounds you know busted as all get out but i definitely would have to imagine that something unexpected will happen in 2024 from a gameplay mechanic perspective and there's still a lot of stuff obviously ultras are still very 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 so few of them they're still very limited there's what what 12 of them in the game 13 something like that 12 or 13 in the game so they're still super limited or is it 14 anyways there's not that many is all i'm trying to say there's not that many so there's still a lot they could do with it by the way tickets are just are just not this is not tickets are not it tickets are not it yo i just i just want to point that out to everyone watching this video don't do tickets. i did this for the content don't do tickets it maybe doesn't feel as bad when you kind of just do like you get like enough to do like three or six and you're like do it and you're like damn i didn't get anything it's super noticeable when you do 18 back to back to back sorry uh 16 17 and you get nothing no legends limited which i know minus the featured new ones are very low on the, you know, the pull rate no of the new units we haven't gotten an ultimate gohan we haven't gotten i mean cool instant transmission we haven't gotten you know super saiyan blue kaioken nothing Oh, that's kind of cool. We got instant transmission for instant transmission Goku. They're scared to Zenkai that unit, by the way. That's one. That's one of those old, old units that they are scared to Zenkai. Him, Super Saiyan God, Goku, the red one. Anyways, so I, I'm just like genuinely excited to see what they do with 2024. Like, what, what does January look like? Because last year January was pretty packed. It's one of those I don't think you think about too much, but in retrospect, you're like, damn. Okay, in January we got 17, who is arguably one of the going to be one of the best aging units in the game for probably a long while and then we got ultra hit who and he's aged but like still ultra hit and 17 in the same month in january please final ticket right now so not to get more tickets but final ticket please 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 rainbow 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 
Broly. All right, we got it. We got to. We got to see it. We got to see if we get the. We got to see if we get the clash or the the shatter dimension. Please, bro. Please, dude. An ultimate go on here would be very clutch. But yeah, dude. It'll like obviously we still have so much to get through, right? We have presumably a part two, you know, and then obviously the part three that will presumably be an ultra. Oh, it didn't break. Dude, is it, is it, no way is it, no way is it not go on. Gotta protect everyone. Let's go, dude. Oh my gosh, bro. All right, the ticket, the, the 10 tickets were worth it. So I bought one ticket. So I traded 42 of these. So it would have taken 45 to get even less Z power than I just got on that. So the gamble was worth it. I could get one more. Do I get one more? You know what? For the content. All right, we're going to do, you know what? We'll save that one for the very, 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 very end. Here we go. Please, bro. We got the Gohan. Surely I will walk away from this. 20 tickets, one Legends Limited unit, and it was the Gohan. So it was the prized possession. I couldn't have asked for more there. I wonder how you get Blue Vegeta. I know how you get Blue Vegeta, by the way. I wonder how you get Blue Goku with Barnog. Do you have to get multiple Legends Limited units? Is that the only way for that to happen? Like, is that why it is so rare? I just, I genuinely don't know how you would get that animation. And I want to know so bad. I want that animation to happen to me so bad. I feel like it's, it's, I'm asking for too much, but I'm not because I just want to see it happen, you know, just for the one time. Legends Limited. This was another one we talked about in the Ryudin video. I don't know if it was on his part or my part, but what about what about part two as a tag Rose and Zamasu? Again, I've seen people say like tag units are overplayed, but I'm like, I don't know, bro. Dad, dad, dad. I don't know, man. Like you give me a tag Rose with Zamasu and now we might be cooking, bro. It's on blue skies. It's gonna be legends on it. He could be the ultra, by the way. Everyone's saying SSA for Gogeta, and it feels like it should be Gogeta, but he could be the ultra. <laughs> I think the ultra is still up in the air. I really do think it. I think it is. I think it is a 95% chance it's Gogeta, but I think there is still a, a, a definite chance it's not Gogeta because, and I know this is always in his time slot, but Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, it would be his three year anniversary for anniversary. It'd be his three anniversary, four anniversary, right? He was the third anniversary. He could come back and be the sixth anniversary as an ultra dude. Release all of your power. I'm putting everyone's hopes into this one attack. Dude, these these units are like, hang on. They're like 0 0.25, 0 0.25. And I got a back to back 5%, five. Why? Why? I like the tag, dude. I want to get more of the tag, dude. Please. But what are the odds I'm getting three Legends Limited back to back? And also, we didn't. I'm losing. I'm just straight up losing. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. All right, I bought the other ticket for the Kaioken banner, but I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the Gohan one first, and then the Kaioken. One. <laughs> this green skies, dude. This is not this is this thing is not gonna be anything. I'm still gonna see what happens, but it's not gonna be anything. Yeah, they haven't touched all the gods either. I definitely think that's that's probably in our future. I mean, I, I do think guessing themes for months next year wouldn't be that hard, but it'd be interesting to see what they end up doing with the units specifically. Green skies. But yeah, I think, uh, well, okay. I think trying to guess what ultra specifically they might do is obviously difficult, but I think putting together a pool of units that could be potential ultras within the near future wouldn't be that difficult. Because I think there are some characters that are pretty like prime and ready for the taking and those obvious picks or probably obvious picks for a reason fake out into a legends limited please Jim, i'll defeat you myself time for us to show you the power of two saiyans the one more bro 99 percent of people quit before they get there to the one more let's go that's the video that's red three freaking blue duo can i talk can you click on a video right here you're gonna love it i know you are i'll see you all in the next one bye